Hello and welcome to Software to See from Festo. In this video I will show you how you can add devices to a Festo Automation Suite project. For that purpose, we are starting with a new project. On the right hand side, you can then see the device repository, which is filled with the devices which are supported by the plugins you've got installed. In order to add a device, browse the catalog and add a device by dragging and dropping double-clicking or using the blue button. Via the search box that you can find on top of the device repository, you can either search for a part number or an order code. So if I enter CMMT ASC2, you now see the search results for the supported devices. And again, you can add this to your project. And the search box also supports searching in the internet. So when searching for CMMT ST, for example, which is the extra low voltage server drive, um, which I do not have the plugin installed for, I nevertheless find the search results here. These are the three supported devices for which a plugin exists. Now, if I add such a device to my project, I could now have the plugin downloaded and installed and then afterwards continue to work. Next possibility to add a device to the project is to search the local network. By clicking on the magnifier tab here, the local network is searched and you see all the devices which are connected to your PC. Just select a device to import, add it to your project. And now also all the data is uploaded from the device. If there are parameters already on the device, they are uploaded and copied into the project. Now the data has been imported. If we check the plugin, you see that the drive configuration has already been filled with the data which is currently active on this drive. Similarly, you can also import devices from the global network scan. Select a device and click on Add to Project in the right sidebar. That's the device that I've just added. If the dimensioning of a drive system has been done with positioning drives, the dimensioning software from Festo, you can also import the data from positioning drives. In order to do so, just open the backstage menu, import positioning drives, and choose the positioning drives project file. The drive is then imported, and if we have a look into the plugin, then we can see that the drive configuration is already in place. So next to the server drive, the motor, the axis, and the mounting kit have been added to the project. These were the different possibilities how you can add devices to a Festo Automation Suite project. If you like the videos, please subscribe to our channel and keep yourself informed. See you next time. Bye.